Hey guys, welcome to another episode of NickMcD.TV. Now today I was going to show you guys how to make a, a transparent terminal on your desktop. Permanently on your desktop. It's always there and it's uh, pretty cool. Let me show you guys. Okay guys, now this is what I wanted to show you. This right here. As you can see, it's a terminal, but it's on my desktop and it has no borders, uh, nothing else. And you can't minimize it and it's on all my desktops. And it's pretty cool. Now you can also make it fully transparent like this. I just like the, the slight back black background because um, it's easier for me to see. To install this thing, it's really easy. First, you have to make sure you have CCSM installed. So go down to Applications, click on Ubuntu Software Center, and then in the search bar, type in CCSM, and you can see right here, Advanced Desktop Effects Settings, and then click the little button, and click Install. It's already installed on mine, so it says Remove. After that's installed, go to System, Preferences, Comp is Config Settings Manager. This is where we're going to do all the setup, but first we've got to make a new terminal profile. First, you got to open up a new Xterm, and if you don't know how to do that, then this tutorial probably isn't for you. Then go to Edit, Profiles, Create a New Profile, Name it. I named mine BG Term 1234. You want to kind of pick a cryptic name because the way this works is it grabs um, the names and it does this stuff. So if you pick like a name like Term, then anything with the word Term, it's going to do all these effects still. So pick a cryptic name. Now make your new term. We'll pick, uh, you know, test. You know, we'll pick uh, BG term uh, dash new. Yeah, that's it. BG term dash new. And create it. Now, what you want to do is unclick show menu bar. In the title and commands, you want to name it the same name. So, BG term new. Copy that over to the initial title. You want to uh, have it keep initial title. This is really important. Don't forget this. The color, um, you know, I, I you can pick whatever you want. I have green on black. Background transparency, yes. Let's make it fully transparent. Scrolling, eh, those are pretty good. And yeah, that's it. That's all you really have to do here. Now that you have your new profile, just close this. And to open up a terminal with that profile, if you go, if you have your, your other terminal open, to hit File, New Terminal, and you'll see your profiles here. So BG Term Dash New is the new one, and as you can see, it's fully transparent. So close that puppy and let's get started. Open up Compiz Settings, the, the thing that we had opened earlier, and you want to click on Window Management. The settings you're going to change are going to be in Window Rules. So the easiest way to do this is to have one of your new terminals open. And then for like the skip taskbar, click the plus button, click Window Title and hit Grab and then click on your, your new uh, profile for your uh, thing. Click it and you can see now it says BG Term Dash New. And then when you click Add, it'll add it to it. Now I'm not going to change my settings because I already have it set up, but it's going to say title equals then whatever your name is. Then just copy that with control C or you know, middle mouse click and paste that into skip taskbar, skip pager, below, sticky, non-movable windows, non-resizable windows, uh, non-minimizable windows, and non-maximizable windows, and non-closable windows. So they're all going to look the same. Now in size rules, do the same thing, hit new. And then for the name, you want to have title equals the same thing as before. And just say, uh, this is going to be the size of the window. So just say how big you want it. Now hit back. And then you want to go to um, place windows. Click on fixed window placement and windows with fixed positions. Hit new. And you want to put for the, the positioned windows, put title equals whatever your window is called. 
and then this is gonna be where it's gonna start on the screen. So mine's starting 400 pixels over from the left and 50 pixels down. Now the last thing you, oh okay, almost the last thing you wanna do is you wanna click on effects and window decoration. Okay, now when it says decoration windows, it's just gonna say any, just like this one. Now you wanna click on the plus button, click on window title, grab, and grab your window. And then you wanna click invert and add that to it. And then it's now gonna look just like mine, just like mine, except yours is going to say uh, title equals whatever your title is. Last thing you wanna do is click on general, and then in general options, where it says hide, skip, taskbar, windows, uncheck it. And that's it, you're done. So uh, now whenever you open a window, if you open a new window, here, let, let's exit mine real quick. Ooh. As you can see, I now have no terminal on my desktop. So if I hit terminal, what we said, and there it is on my desktop. Last thing you're gonna do, if you want this terminal to auto start when you log in, go down to System, Preferences, Startup Applications. Now you wanna click Add. I'm just gonna show you guys mine. Oh, oh man. And for the name, name it whatever you wanna name it. And for the command, type in GNOME dash terminal dash dash window dash with dash profile equals your profile name which is mine is BG term one two three four and then you can comment it whatever you like and now that this desktop terminal will start up whenever you log into your profile the way to test this out is to log out and log back in and see if it works if you have any questions or comments leave them below catch you guys next time